Hi everyone and welcome back. Let's see how we can use OSL to scatter images like graffiti and stickers. Let's start by copying the, these OSL codes from this random bitmap file on GitHub, originally created by Zepp Anderson and modified by Saul Spinoza. So create an OSL Arnold node, paste the code and hit compile. Now we have a ton of attributes, the first we need to change is the file input, we have 10 in total. I found that in order for this to work you will need to paste the path of the PNG image to every input, even if you're only going to use two or three. So let me just copy one image for now and paste in the file inputs. You can use the input to connect a background color or, ju or just use a flat color. Let's scale down the effect. You can use the global scale and also the random scale attributes. We can also give it some random rotation. Adding now more images to the stack. Make sure in the layers attribute you have enough to render the new images. There's also a seed value to change the overall scattering. Another attribute you can change is the probability. You can decrease this value to have less instances. You can play with the position of the instances, but it may cut off your images. To solve that, you will need to increase the overlap value. And there are more options like fixed values for rotation and probability options. I encourage you to watch the Zap Anderson video on this OSL node. For the final image, I just added more stickers and played with the seed. So, the next step would be to create a nice interface for the shader and actually have a local compiled file that we can have always available in the hypershade. And also create the necessary metadata file to create the necessary outputs like the alpha so we could plug it to a layered shader. But I'll leave that for another time. That's all for now, I hope this can help you in a future project. Bye bye.